Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. I'm back with another meal idea. So today we're making shrimp fried rice. This is chicken that I have here, just a regular chicken breast. And then I also post the seasonings on the screen that I'm gonna use. So we got some steak and some shrimp here. It's like the shrimp fried rice. Well, in my mind, I was going with the idea of the shrimp fried rice from Hibachi or Kinku. So I decided to bring the griddle out. And girl, I tried to set the onions up how they do it and everything. But I just couldn't do the little fancy tricks. Um, so I grabbed some of them frozen vegetables out of the freezer. Threw them things on there. Shall we have some shrimp in there? Brought that out. Oh, they say use a day old rice, some day old rice, but that rice was less than a few hours. I just left it out and let it cool off. Once it cooled off, I put it in the freezer for a little while. And um, it turned out pretty good. So you can use day old rice or you can cook it a few hours, you know, and just let it sit out for a minute. So, you know, we got to have that egg in there. Got to throw the egg in there, so I'm just getting my egg ready right here. Yeah. This rice turned out so good. We ate on this for two days. Yeah. And I got a family of five, so yeah, we ate on this for two days. Because I ended up doing the noodles, too. Put some sesame oil, fish oil. Don't use a lot, though. Just use a little razzle-dazzle. And then if you notice, I didn't use no salt throughout the whole seasoning of the the meats and stuff because the soy sauce has enough salt in it, so you ain't need no extra salt. So we got us some noodles, honey. I put some oil and butter at the bottom. I put some butter on the top again. Boom. 